Okay, so I just filmed the video and press play and press record. So I have now opened the box. For sake. Okay, hi guys, it's Tams, the Wicked Witch. Welcome back to the channel. This has been like, I've been like this all day. This is my wonky broomstick unboxing. <laughs> I've opened it. The box was damaged anyway. I've opened it and I don't press record. So I'm just going to do a quick... I thought I'd have a new subscription box, okay? It's not on the scale of which casket, which box and all that. It's only small. It's independent, little shop. But it is 29 odd quid. So I, I was expecting a bit more in it, okay? I did go back through to see whether they had perhaps missed off some stuff. But they hadn't. In this box, okay, it's called the Wonky Broomstick. It's a shop in Glastonbury. They do a monthly subscription. So in this box, you've got a hanging sunflower for Leafa. This box is all themed around Leafa summer solstice coming, okay? It also had in it a list of things, and I checked a little ritual list, and this card says Leafa, okay? And a bit about summer solstice and a little a little affirmation spell type thing i can't read it it's too small so this was in the box okay so we got this sunflower which is very cute and i really love sunflowers as you know i love them there's sunflowers behind me i do i love them so i'm gonna hang this over here somewhere so i'm very pleased with that you got that in the box and then you got this, which is a box of a sun on it. Now, I was already excited. It's called Rose Quartz Keep Safe. And when you pop it open, it's got a Rose Quartz sun in it. Sorry about the nails. So the box is very cute, okay? You know, if you watch this channel, I love things with suns and moons on them. I'm just like, I love anything. And this is the cutest thing, okay? So I was quite excited about that. And then this bag, and that's it. So in this bag, you've got Santa Palo, a little green candle, Santa Palo, this little leaf of spray, a tiny little scroll, and these two little miniature bags of herbs. And it's a leafer bag, and it's very cute, but that's it in the box for nearly 30 quid. Yeah, um, probably the most light box I've ever had. <laughs> so I'm not moaning about it. I'm not a greedy person, but this was probably the most smallest stuff in a box I've ever had. So I have already ordered another one and then that'll probably be it. We'll see. The next one might be full. I love this. I love the box, but, you know, not for that price. So, yeah, a bit disappointed, but never mind. Let's put that there. So, and you got all those leaflets, but they weren't kind of, you know, they're just bits of paper. So it wasn't like you could really keep them and they weren't pretty. A bit disappointed and not being rude to them. You know, they're called the Wonky Broomstick. It's a shop in Glastonbury and they've got their own subscription box. Uh, you know, it's in little independent shops. I'm not moaning. I'm just saying I'm sorry, but that is really light. Even though it's ever so cute. There's a little candle in there and that. But yeah, I did think that that was really bad. But there you go. Nice stuff, but just not enough of it for 30 quid. So adding on to this video, because this would be it. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. There is a buffer in my garden, which is sort of here. Sorry over here <laughs> yeah sorry about that um it's come out the van <laughs> um it has to stay there we have nowhere to put it uh yes getting back on the subject so me and my director were in chelmsford visiting a site obviously because i'm an area manager for a cleaning company we was visiting a site we had a meeting we took a little stroll because we were well early to the organic coffee shop which had closed which was a shame Ter terrible shame it was lovely and we took a little stroll down there and we carried on walking and there was a little shop lustrous gifts i think it was called lust lustrous gifts it's like a little crystal spiritual shop so we went in and bought a few things so i'm gonna do the little hole it's very small I'm gonna do the little hole from there just to make this video longer because there were so few items in the box it isn't really a video is it it's me sitting here <laughs> um not with anything so we so yeah, we went into um, we went into Lustrous Gifts. It's in Molsham, Molsham Street in Chelmsford in Essex. We usually go to the uh, Raven's Nest, which is in the market in Chelmsford. 
um, when we go out to these sites and we go and have lunch in the town. But today, uh, sorry, yesterday we had to kill 15, 20 minutes um, and we found this little shop. We hadn't seen it before. I don't think we've ever walked that way before, to be honest. So in this shop, they have loads of incense and I bought these, which are dragon's blood. And the make of these incense is, um, oh, I can't even read it. Oh, I can't read the make of it. Oh, the classic collections by Stamford. I think that's what it is. Yeah, is Stamford incense. So I bought this frankincense and, and myrrh because it smells really kind of like earthy. And you know, I don't like soap smells. It was really nice. So I just bought that and I just bought some dragon's blood. But it had a bit more of a twang to it. Um, it's really like, yeah, it's really nice. Really like proper dragon's blood smell for Morrigan. So I bought two lots of incense and then my boss bought me. She always buys me something whenever we go out. We go out a couple of times a month. And if we go to a shop every couple of months, because we get don't get much time when we're out normally. But if we do get to go to one of these shops, she always buys me something. And she bought me this cushion. And I love mushrooms and I'm obsessed with things with mushrooms on them. And this is like soft this is a handmade cushion and this is the company that make it look they're called um the skull shed and look at their little label everything's all sewn handmade oh my god the cushion i am like wow i absolutely love mushrooms this would be well cute on a purse can you imagine or a bag yeah it's beautiful it's very very witchy <laughs> I was very, very pleased with it. So she bought me that from the shop. And also, they also had handmade makeup and pencil cases. How could I leave this? Oh, my God. Loads and loads of Halloween skulls on a makeup bag. I'll probably use it as a pencil case to take my pens in. I was so excited about it. It was like four quid. And I bought that. Oh, my God. I forgot something. Oh, I've... Oh, no, here it is. So I thought I'd forgot something. Right, so I bought that. And then she had, you know, I love moons. She'd made these key rings and it's got a piece of a gate, bit of moss agate, I think. Look, she's made this moon, bit of moss agate. Oh, my God, I'm a loving it. They were like three or four quid. Well, my work phone, sorry, is going off. It'll have to hang on. <laughs> I'm making a video. <laughs> oh, my God. I was like, how cute is this? It's a key ring. That is just adorable. I'm loving it. So cute. So yeah, proper, proper sweet. I, I just love it. So yeah, I bought that as well. As you know, I can't leave a moon. I'm sure it's Mossagate. It is, yeah. I think it's a piece of Mossagate. Either that or it's painted very well to look like it. But yeah, how cute is that? Right. And then, no, that's it. Did I buy a house? Oh no, she so she bought, I think she bought a wand and she bought uh she bought a wand. Oh, and she bought earrings and she bought some, a couple of crystals, I think. I didn't buy any crystals, I was really good. I was looking though. So that was that. And then off of eBay, I bought this. It's not gonna stay on this, on this um fake leather robe, but this is solid silver, and I bought that. I did have quite a long one that used to dig in and I gave that one to my mum. This is smaller to go on my silver necklace. So hopefully it will sort of sit there or it will sit sort of down there. But yeah, I've got to swap it. So yeah, I bought this off of eBay. I don't know who the seller was, but it's solid silver. So I bought that, crow's gold, and I bought this. Now I was a little bit disappointed with this because it's a snake like the robberus. And it's got the tree and the moon and the sun in it, but like in the middle. But it's silver plated. I mean, what do you expect? It was from China. I should have read it properly. But it is only 925 silver plated. So, but it is really cute. But it looked a lot better. It did look a lot better on the. I was ang I did have it round here like that. But it looked a lot better on the. And it's like proper proper crappy it was not very expensive so i don't know what i was thinking i was getting but it is still quite cute and i do like the snake like the robber snake 
and it's like obviously devouring itself and the moon and all of that moon sun tree of life yeah it is cute but i actually have it hanging near the altar i don't even know if i'll wear it but it's uh it's not silver and i'm a little bit fussy about that so yeah i have a little hole there just to make this video a bit longer but let's just reflect on this cushion because i'm so in love with this cushion how cute is it it's proper cute right i'm loving it i hope you like my little haul from lustrous gifts in molsham street in chelmsford in essex in the uk and my very small subscription box from the wonky broomstick but let's not let's not say that that box is adorable if you're a suns and moons person and i am it is proper sweet with the rose quartz sun i mean i love it this is a beautiful little gift bag and it is a beautiful little uh sunflower that hangs but it's just not 30 quids worth of subscription box is it so a little bit disappointed we'll get one more because i think i've already paid for it and see how it goes if not i probably won't get any more but yeah you've got to try these things haven't you anyway if you like this kind of stuff please hit the like button please subscribe and all that hit the bell and yeah i'll be back with i'm gonna do something witchy tomorrow mm, maybe for my new witches and maybe i'll do something else um have a few things i want to do yeah, I'll be back with videos and obviously for the weekend you'll have some shorts and some horror stuff. So yeah, I'll see you all soon. Take care, ta -da.